Hello YouTubers, it's Champion DJK coming at you yet again with another mail find video. We did one yesterday from Travis and today we got one. I got another box in the mail today from uh, at HWDieCast209. They call him the godfather of diecast. Uh, check him out on Instagram. Uh, big time M2 chase collector. I guess he, he, he likes chase pieces of all kinds. Uh, but he approached me with an ultra red for trade and uh, Definitely was interested in it. It's a pretty sweet one, and we'll show you that in a moment because I'm sure it's in this box. And uh, he said to send him back, or he, you know, he's, he's a chase collector, so I, the only thing I really had was this white lightning to offer him uh, in trade for that. And he just said, you know, put me together a mystery box and send something back to this, and that's it. That's all, he, that's all he wanted. So, and obviously, there's not just an ultra red in here unless he packed it like an egg, um, which he is good at, uh, at packing stuff very neatly and uh, so it doesn't get damaged so I wouldn't be surprised if he'd be able to actually pack an egg and have it not crack from Michigan to here so anyway that aside we are going to open this lovely box of diecast goodness and let's uh, venture right into it um, so anyway his name's Steve um, I've had limited contact with him except for on Instagram and from what I gather he is just an awesome dude I mean you can see boxes uh, being sent to all sorts of YouTubers from him. Um, I know he recently sent one to, uh, I believe, KP's Toys, Kyle. He sent one to, I think, Pete's Diecast, too. I could be wrong. But anyway, he's sent out some boxes to some, some YouTubers, and he's just a really cool dude. Um, and just sends back stuff that's like, okay, well, how am I going to repay you? Uh, but anyway, regardless... Very cool dude. He came right to me with this this ultra red that he found the night before because he knows I love Auto World and uh, that's just really cool of him to do so. I wish I had some sweet M2 chase or something to send him in return for this. So I'll be looking out for that. Obviously, I owe you, buddy. I really do. Especially since the first box you sent me was a complete R.A. Okay, and man, you just you're the best. So I'm just gonna kind of. Of course, it's got some. We got peanuts. are great. We'll reuse those. And then, of course, there's more than one car here. And he packed it amazingly well. Um, we got this little guy here. We'll check that out in a second. And I just want to make sure I'm not missing anything here. Looks like we just got, I'm guessing, three pieces here. All right, let's take a look. So first off, Auto World, GTO. That is really sweet. I do have this one, but I will crack this one. And uh, or maybe not this one. If I got if the other one I have is in our worst card, I'll go ahead and crack that. But we'll do that in the weekly video. Um, but anyway, super cool. Thank you very much. I love Auto World. Um, oh boy, what do we got in here? And again, amazing packing job. meticulously pull this out here as it was meticulously packed and yes. all right so there you go this is the ultra red in question um, this is really sweet okay this is the uh, the normal release of this vehicle is one of 1836 so it's already limited so obviously the ultra reds are pretty limited. And the way I figure it is probably somewhere between 75 to 100 some, depending on if it's like 2 to 3%. Because you got to basically, and we don't need to get into this too much, but multiply that number times 2 because that's the two different colors and the two different sets because it's the same ultra red for both. So this is C and D release ultra red uh, for release 5. Okay, And I already have... and I. Did not prepare for this, unfortunately, but I do have the other ultra red of this car that has the white um, rims on these tires, and that one is from release A and B. So there is a variation in ultra reds from the A and B releases and the C and D releases. And if I, I'm not mistaken, that is also the case for the way Racing Champions is doing their stuff, and same with Johnny Lightning. So now the releases are going to have an A, B, C, and D. They're all limited now. And the A and B has their own chase. 
the C and D has its own chase, and they vary slightly. So that's a pretty neat round, too, uh, but it does cause me to have a lot more to collect. Um, but anyway, this is killer, because this is release um, C, and, C and D. So now I have all of it from this, except for, of course, the Ultra Raws, which if I ever get one of those, I'll do a backflip on camera. Um, but there's that. <clears throat> And let's see what this other little surprise piece is. And it is the old 442. And this is getting cracked for sure because I know I already got it. Um, this is release 5. So this would have been in the same... Or no, it's not because this is not released... I think this is release 5 set A. I think it's set A. It's either set A or set B. I'm not sure. But it's not set C or D. But same release with this. All right, so there's a little auto world education, which I love to do. And uh, there's another great chase piece sent to me from, from Steve. From HW Diecast 209. Follow him on Instagram. Just a cool dude. Um, just really, really neat guy. And uh, just, I don't know, in, enjoy getting stuff like this. It's just so cool that people are coming to me uh, with Ultra Reds for trade. Um, the unfortunate thing is I don't have a lot of trade bait right now currently, so sorry guys. But I will hook you up with something. I'm definitely going to put something together for you. I got that white lightning aside for you, and I'm also going to, I have to put something else in there. I just do, um, you know, for your generosity, which I very much appreciate. So that's going to be it for this video, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, we'll film a weekly vid. I did find a super this week, so we'll film a week weekly vid on either Saturday or Sunday. Take a close-up look at some of this stuff, uh, maybe crack a few things, and have fun as usual. So, you guys have a great weekend. I hope you find a lot of stuff, um, and that's going to be it. So, have a good night.